Alright, let's do this game. I say we do it. Play it. Kings Grizzlies. Kings Grizzlies in Sacramento. Let's do it. It's gonna be a good game. It's gonna be a very good game. The ticket began with the play-in game. Kings guard versus Warriors gaming. That's squad. the wrong Kings. Line up. It's a different Kings, man. The 2K it's Sports a different Kings. Pre game show. Pre game show. All right. Here we go, Plenty boys. It's gonna be very good. Tip off very good. A little New Year's Eve hoops. This is New Year's Eve. Eve. Again? New Five, Year's four, Eve. Three, it counts two, at midnight. Five, it's not midnight. Three. Oh God, they're getting old, man. They're trying to. They're kind of. They're trying to celebrate New Year's Eve at like 9 p.m. No, the game started at like 7 p.m. Come on. Little dip on his new team, the Sacramento Kings. We got Holy Fook coming off the bench for the Grizzlies. Probably one of the best six man in the league. In Sacramento, Memphis trying to take down the Kings. The Kings have been playing well. The Kings have been playing well. They shook up their team a little bit. They grabbed Little Dip from the Portland Trailblazers. And they are looking to turn this season around. Five games below 500. He is, that is, a, is an inter interesting looking man. Here we go. Shredded Hobbit. Ooh. We just watched him not too long ago, actually. So after we watch this, this Grizzlies game, it'll be a while since we see the Grizzlies again because I think we watched them last session as well. Reese O'Neal, CJ White is the matchup of the night. Here we go, boys. Can the Kings get their 16th win of the year? Can they change? Keep this. Can they change the season up? Can they get it going? I don't know, man. Grizzlies are good. Grizzlies are very good. We know Shredded Hobbit is a goddamn monster. But little dips on him. They've got the closer. Bodyguard is out there with O'Neal. Then it's big All right, good defense by the Kings right thus far. The Shredded! Oh, it's blocked perfected. inside for, by, is that Pacor? I think that was a block by Pacor. Dillard to Walrus, high off the glass, no good. Nearly, nearly got a quick bucket man, off the great defensive the bench, stop. You know your role. Hobbit already night, shut down on the dunk attempt. Especially on the roll. And you're going to see Hobbit try to do that a few more times in this game. But for a couple of stretches, we'll see if the Kings can shut him down. Reese O'Neal over into the corner. Back to Jordan. a man in his face. No good. In and out. Both teams looking for their first basket. An easy layup for Mr. White down low. And the Kings are on the board. They've got two. Even though they were facing very little resistance, they refused to play down to the level of their competition. Kings are out in front. Reese O'Neal over to Dongerson. Yo, Dongerson's crazy. In the paint. On the block, lays it up with the left hand. Pacor couldn't get to it. They're tied, 2-2. Yeah, make sure you guys vote in the straw poll on who you guys think is going to win this, this matchup. We're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. Pass to D. I don't know, man. With the way Memphis has been, been playing, I think maybe Memphis is going to... Oh! Dongerson falling down. They don't call it Pacor. Hits the wide open three. That's what you get. It really changes. Come on, Dongerson, stay on your feet, you flopper. Opens up opportunities for everyone. Makes the offense its most dynamic. Sacramento up by three. Oh, that looked like some good defense. Diller gets called for the foul. Zuma tried to go for the slam. Averaging 13 points a game, big Zuma. Two of two from the field, or from the free throw line. Excuse me. And leadership to the locker room. Hey, I like, I'm glad you like it, Drunken Rogue. Thanks for watching, buddy. Appreciate you, man. And the Kings are in a rebuild mode, and you need vets to lead that process. Show the youngsters. Little shake and bake. Oh, blocked from behind. Get that weak shit out of here, Walrus. As they begin this rebuild. Memphis with a chance to take the lead. Zuma taking it all the way. Slams it. Memphis up by one. Some nice ball movement here by the Kings. Zach Picor. Oh, he got his man. Inside. Inside to White with the left hand. Gets his own board. Puts it up again, and it's good. Reese O'Neal, not enough. And the Kings retake the lead by one.
You know, there is nothing more frustrating than that. Giving up points on a possession you won. In the corner. Now, Lamian, Lamian Dillard About three minutes gone, was the, the leader quarter. here for the uh, for the Kings last game in the win. He hasn't really done much yet. Not. Hobbit drives. From him, gets the, the foul call. CJ White picks up his first. Grizzlies last season, second to last in scoring. First Nothing one is good. Second one is good. Mr. Hobbit. No team in the league has won Puts the Grizz up by one. Perfect from the line. Points or less Dude. Memphis. Well, I think Hobbit can dunk on anyone. I think that, that oh, alley-oop to Dillard. Puts it in with a right. Great pass by Walrus. Or was that Little Dip? Might have been Little Dip. No, that was Walrus, wasn't it? I didn't know where it was going. Kings retake the lead by one, man. Already a ton of lead changes. Hobbit driving in, blocked inside by Little Dip. Hobbit is getting worked. Walrus tries with the left. No good. Stop by Jordan. Coming off a 24-point win for Walrus. Gets Phoenix. turnovers. They offensive rebound and they get to the line. That's Going to Hobbit again. Drives in, lays it in with the left. Hobbit continuing all the way. to attack We've the basket. The this time it works out. Quite a bit in this one. And it's hey another guys, lead change. Each team knows they can win this game. Just a matter who can catch that momentum. Dip up floater with the right. Easily no good. The Reese Boy, he blew with the board. Jordan Ames, fast break. He is furious with himself. Going to get slowed down, though. Kings make That's the stop. One point lead, Memphis with a chance to extend it a little Here's further. The 20 points for him last game against the Warriors in Oakland. Good ball also, movement here from the Grizzlies. The rebounding. Hobbit area where he behind the back, it. driving in defense right on him though. Dongerson tips it to himself. The bodyguard passes to Red Hot. Hobbit to O'Neal, Jordan Ames to Hobbit. Dude, Hobbit is a ball hog, bro, come on. Trying to the set a screen. The, the defense, though. Jordan hits the three. The and the Grizzlies the game, have their largest lead of the game. And they can't allow him they to lead by four. Like that. Ooh, good that, defense. That's just Whoa, brother. What? Trouble. That was a double dribble. The fuck? That man totally picked up his dribble. Walrus with a move. No good. The defense by Jordan is too strong. Fast break opportunity. And he's going to be fouled. Going to the line, shooting two. My overall record, this was a competitive match. Good person to foul. Very good person to foul. Oh my lord! Oh. So Memphis going with almost an entire new group here. The Wizards checked in for the bodyguard. Prime time comes in. Oh brother! All right, well. And smooth. Definitely foul, Jordan. That is a very good decision. Too quick in bed. Here's lights out. The assisting nice maestro in the game for the Kings. Step back. Hits the game. jumper. He's one for one. Brings the Kings within two. To but Holy Fook is in the game for the Grizzlies. Now we know this man can do it all. He's going for that sixth man of the year award. For three. Oh, nearly got it. Just a little long. Sacramento with a chance to tie or take the lead on this possession. Into the corner. Quick and bet again. 114 left to play in the first quarter. Trying to set something up. There's the pick. Ooh, over to Dillard. Lays it in with a right. No good. Gets his own board. Puts it back up with a left, and it's good. Tied up 13. 13. So I plan on playing Walking Dead. Oh my god. Absolutely, Centurion. Absolutely, bro. I cannot wait. Oh, dude, Ruben can hit that. Sleeper. To Out to Jordan for a three. He hit the other one and he hits this. He's perfect from behind the arc. 16-13 Grizzlies lead. This one's got the feeling like it's gonna go down to the wire. I'm loving this one. It's been back and forth, back and forth with these lead changes. Quick and bad drive. Pull up. Oh, dude, he almost got that over Ruben. That would have been nuts. He's going to knock those down when he is that open. Extending can extend the lead past three. The alley oop. No good. Dillard. He's been playing pretty well. D passes Over to, to Teske. Here's lights out. Yeah, I don't know why Jordan's can shoot threes, but he can't hit free throws. Four on the clock. Quick and bad. Step back. Got room, and he hits it. Ooh. 
pulls the Kings within five to end the first. Too quick in bed, comes off the bench, hits some shots. That was nasty. That was Zuma's dunk right off the court. Bald ass Dongerson celebrating. Wait, that man was in his warm up celebrating on the court. What is he doing? Great defense, a lot of blocks. This has been a good game thus far here on Chris, or not Christmas Eve, on New Year's. New Year's Eve. Nice dance moves, King. Get it, baby. Get it, baby. Ooh, ooh, ooh. One point lead for the Grizzlies, but the Kings are going to be starting with the ball the here trailing. in the second. G out there with the bodyguard. Then it's free. Looking then bad, then still free. in the game. He's and been playing right well. In at the point guard position. Fleshman. That's the five. Fleshman. The for the Drives with a right hand. No good. Oh, Ruben oh, gets up. Two chances at the fouls. Fleshman going to the line, Steve shooting two. For your three point shooting. Averaging nearly more six more points a game. The four and shoot threes. We've heard some legends. It's the first free like throw. Isaiah gets Thomas the second free throw. And the Kings the retake the lead by that? one. You know, me and Isaiah, we've definitely talked about it. And I look at it. If yes, I recall, yes, Jordan James wanted to be super fucking garbo at free throws or something three. along those if lines. He has a 25 free throw, throw lowest possible. Oh, my <laughs> two to three. Well, well foul Jordan Any chance you get, the man cannot shoot free throws. Sleeper! Oh, with the move! The and one! Up and under. You gotta defend, you gotta rebound. The three point play out. is good. Grizz out game. back by, by two. Things, back out by three. two, excuse me. They really haven't the best teams in history always had guys that can do different things. A ball All right, runner, Kings, rebounder, let's go. Keep it together. Screener, a, a long shooter. Don't let them pull away. A combination of all oh, things. pulls up from the elbow and right gets it. Oh my God, dude. Two quick and bet is a beast. In the last two or three years, we are tied back up 19 19, the third tie of the game. Seven lead changes. We're about a minute into the second quarter of play. The Ruben back to Stanton. Pass to the Wizard. Over to Sleeper again. This Shot is a little bit of a five. size mismatch. Hope Stolen by Dillard. Beautiful defense by the Kings. Oh, here's Freak. He points Behind the back. Game. Oh, it's, oh, hey, Teske picked it up. Up with the left, and he got it. It was tipped by Ruben, and it still went. It went down. The Kings with a two-point lead. How the hell did that work? Disadvantage. You're looking to score Holy Fook driving in behind the back, blocked inside. Get that shit out of here, Fook. Dillard inside, takes the contact. Foul will be shooting two. Lamian Dillard, 10.6 points per game, 51% from the field, gets both of his free throws to go. And the Kings have got a four point lead. Yo, Regards, thank you for the 44 months, BB. Welcome back, Brosafini. How you doing, Mr. Regards? Sleeper. Put it up, Sleeper. Pass into the corner to Ruben. Holy Fook from way downtown. He knew it. He knew it. Pulls Memphis within one. Oh, my. Holy Fook. They set the pick. Lights out, passes to Freak. Over to Fleischman. To the left wing. Pass to Lights out. Seven on the shot clock. Quick and bad's got to do something. Uses the screen. Defense is strong. Pulls up for three. Woo! Ruben picks up the board. That was close. Memphis with a chance to take the lead. Second quarter of play with almost three minutes gone. Passes it to Big Smooth. To the wing on the left. Double team. Sleeper stolen, stolen by Minin. Fast break opportunity here for the Kings. Hey, Dillard takes it all the way. Lays it in with a right hand. And the Kings are up by three. Trail by three. The pass to prime time. Stanton going Here's to the corner. Zuma wide open for a three. No good. Ruben is there for the the, the rebound. Back out to Zuma. The second chance opportunity, and Zuma nails it. We are tied 25 25. Just under four minutes remaining here in the second quarter. God damn. This is a hell of a game, boys. A hell of a game. And it's red hot in for smooth. 
The Kings have gone right. three or four. We got some subs in coming in. Whole new squad for the Kings. Oh no, Quick and Ben got and moved to shooting guard. Quarter, Walrus in the corner for three. He got it. The Kings take a three point lead once again. Walrus, man, he turned his back on the basket. He knew it was going in. Leave an elite shooter this wide open. Hobbit, ooh, Hobbit's back in the game for the Grizzlies. Let's see if he can take Walrus to the rack. Only Fook will shoot that, bro, that's his range. That's his range. Pulls up, man in his eye. Defense too strong. White gets the board. Kings with a chance to extend the lead. This would be the biggest lead of the game if they can score. Little general, the pass to lights out. They set the pick. Little dip. To the paint. Down to Pacor, blocked inside. Great defense by the Grizzlies. Holy food. The great. Pushing the ball, pushing the tempo. Point game against the Kings Warriors get a good stop, Oakland. though. Holy food coming off a 25 point win right against the Warriors. Kicks it to good pass to Reese O'Neal for the short corner the jumper. Time that one will connect. Leads to assist. And it's a and one point lead. For success. This is it to deep. Here's a little dip to bed. Dude, this is a really good matchup, man. Both teams playing well. To the inside. Alley oop to CJ White. He's got to get rid of it. No good. Oh my God, the defense is enough to disrupt it. And Memphis with a chance to retake the lead. We've got 155 left to play in the first half. There's Big Smooth. Oh, holy fuck. Nah, he's not missing that. You got to guard that man, Memphis. So well that up game. by Keeping 2. Everybody involved. You cannot leave Holy Fook open like that. Oh, that's a mid-range elbow jumper for Walrus and it's good. Quick and bed picks up the assist. Back to 30 for both teams. Neck and neck. A minute 20 left here in the first half. Hobbit drives up with the left, the takes the foul. He'll be going to the line, shooting two. I feel like Little Dip hasn't paint. been doing too much, man. Deep, all broken down the Kings got to get Little Dip hit three. And the one thing that jumps out at me when, when you look at that shot chart is just how little score One of two from, from the line, above. two of the two, shredded perfect. Point range. They've got Grizz, to get more points from out retake the lead by two. The closers checked in for Memphis. See if Little Dip can get his offense going. To the right side. Walrus, he's been playing very well. Goes up with a right. No good. Yeah, Zuma with no the board. Well, Walrus forced that one. Under a minute left here in the first half. Left to play here in the second quarter. Here's Red Hot. Shredded Hobbit from the elbow. Good luck for O'Neal. And the Grizz are up by four. You find the weakness in the defense. Here's lights out. He's got six. Quick in bed. Ooh, he had room. Dude, you have to guard him. He's going, he, he is playing out of his mind. Quick in bed is ridiculous. Coming off the bench, too. Two point game. Pass inside. Oh my God. I don't know how that did not get picked off. Jordan puts it in and lead back up the four for the Grizzlies. Late defensive rotations and getting the ball in the paint. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. A lot of standing around. Book and bed trying to waste a lot of clock. They're going for the final shot of the half. Points for him. There's a good screen. Screen set. Little dip, wide open, three, little dip with a little celebration right there. Pulling the Kings within one. The Hail Mary, no good. The Kings down by one at the half. Little dip connects on the open three, man. That was a great play. That was a phenomenal play, actually. A one point game here in Sacramento. Yo, Blue, thank you for the 26 months, bro. Kevin Welcome back. He says, almost missed my resub. You got it, man. Over two years, Blue. Thank you so half. much, bro. 
Well, we try to go inside. Thank you, David. I don't want and that shit. Who cares about your interview? Come on, quarter. man. Let's get this See shit going. Just a bit. And now, it's New Year's Eve. I got to get home. home. And I got to get home to the stir. Indeed. You know, Welcome we got to go out drinking. I got to be at least blacked out by 11 p.m. I can't remember my New Year's Eve. Come on. Period, but four points was the biggest it got. Three steals to the Kings. The second quarter was dead even in terms of scoring out for both teams. And they still find themselves in a good position at the half. More assists. Jordan's got eight. Dillard's got eight. That's it for half. Pretty even matchup right now, man. He can go either way here in the second half. So fresh and so clean and clean. A lot of action around as always the capital all right tonight. We are second in half action coming at you sacramento sports. down by one here at home and they start with the ball and the chance to take the lead to start the third sacramento's gone three or four from i'd like to see uh, a little dip kind of get more involved action, getting rolling right now you know you, you know what i'm saying all filled up and ready to go here's who's on the floor who walrus wide open he doesn't shoot that apparently not his range then it's the back to little ball. dip then it's o'neal and it's big who's that screen little dip drives pulls up defense by jordames they got to get rid of it White. Oh my God, the defense from the Grizzlies right now. Just too strong. Short aims, mid range. No good. And so many defenses are not designed to take away the mid range jumper, but he's given nothing away. Dillard of Bacor. Bacor really hasn't done too much on offense. Definitely been the backcourt. For the Kings. White, for the White blocked inside the defense by the Grizzlies right now. He's just absolutely insane. Zuma, the inside pass, nearly stolen by Bacor, tipped out of bounds. Grizzlies regain possession. Little dip, a second half player. We'll see, man. We'll see. Ooh, good defense right here by the Kings. Short aims at the elbow. Over to the wing. The double team, no. Passed a big smooth. So nice pass. Stolen by Little Dip. Great now defense. Anticipating the pass. Walrus. No, Little step back. Thought right. he was going to take it. Little Dip with a reset. Bacor for three. Gets it to go. And the Kings are up by two. Oh, what a shot by Bacor. I was just saying he needs to get his offense going, and he does. God damn. Good for that man. Playoff contention, and finally decided to pull the trigger and trade Demarcus Cousins. It marked a major. Dongerson, man. Zuma for three, no good. Dongerson, though. The offensive board and the jump shot is good. We are tied back up, 38-38. Another tie in this game. Holy shit. Core little ISO. Dongerson's on him. Little dip, wide open for three, and he is not going to miss that. Kings out back by three. What is clear is that the Kings wanted to get younger and start rebuilding. And you could argue if the trade was the right move or not. Alley oop inside, no good. Kings with a chance on the fast break. Pacor, little dip in the corner. It's good. Little dip. Three for three in his last three attempts. 44-38. I think this is the Kings' biggest lead of the game. You just need a bucket to get some momentum. The bodyguard Hobbit. See if the Grizzlies can bring this back. Hobbit driving. Therese O'Neal out to Jordames for three. Oh, it looked good. Dongerson. Dongerson! Slapping motherfuckers with his dong. 44-40, the and one. He's going to the line, shooting one more. Oh, my God, the big man owning the paint. Showing him why he's called the dong. Gets the three-point play to go. Pulls the Grizz within three. Teams in the past decade, the big three in Boston. Little dip Miami, again. Drives. Oh, uh, good. Oh, my God. Little dip has 11 points. I'm pretty sure all of that is here in the second half. Little dip playing out of his mind. He is a second half player. I think you were right. Five point lead for the Kings. Alley oop 
No good again. A turnover by the Grizzlies. Trying to do too much. Fleshman. Down low, stolen by Reese O'Neal. Jordames on the fast break. Pulls up from the bow, and it's good. Can't make a free throw, but he can do that. Kings leading now by three. And the pass to the body. Teske. Over to Fleshman. Three point lead for the Kings again. Fleshman drives in with a left, takes the foul. Nearly got the in one. Going to line shooting two. Gets the first to go. Gets the second to go. Perfect from the line. Lead up to five for the Kings here at home. Under three minutes left in the third. Lights out, checked in for the Kings. Pass down low to Holy Fook. He got a good look. Back door worked out easy, too. Got to play some better defense than that, man. Quick and bet is back. He played very well in the first half. Let's see if he can continue this here in the third. Teske. Got his man off his feet. Oh, no, why didn't he drive? He should have taken it all the way. No good on the jumper. And the Grizzlies began their first six seasons, of course, in Vancouver, British Columbia. Ruben in the corner. The big man connects. And we are tied up again. Oh, Ruben caught his man sleeping. The big man stretching the floor. Another tie, 48-48. Quick and bend the alley oop to Teske. How did he see that? Bro, quick and bend is a, an assist maestro, dude. That's tricky. Kings retake the lead by two. That is a ridiculous pass. Sleeper on the block, backing his man down. Turnaround. Gets it to go. Beautiful shot. This is the tenth tie of the game. Or the eighth tie, the tenth lead change. Biggest lead of the game was six. Here's Freak. He's guarded close. Minus. Here's Freak. Pulls up. No good. Fleishman is there for the board. Oh, the defense by the Grizzlies. They're e out rebounding the Kings by eight. Areas, but rebounding has been Jordan Ames mid range. Good look, and he hits it. And it's in there. The size yeah, mismatch, and it's a 14 6 run. Really the Grizzlies have I'll regained control. They lead by two, and the Kings are going to be taking a timeout. With a minute left here in the third. Oh yeah, get it, my man, the mascot. Even with the, I would fall and eat my ass, and I would eat shit. The ass is just for fun. Little dip though, back in the game for the Kings. Too quick and bad from the elbow. No good, man. Defense was good by Shredded. Memphis Fook for three. Good defense. That was a four shot, man. All right, Kings with a chance to tie or take the lead once again. 43 on the clock. 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Little dip off the screen, drives. Off the screen. No the good the on the now jumper. Jump. And the Grizzlies going the other way now. Holy Fook wide open. No good. He's missed two in a row. He's to get it going Sacramento with a chance to end the quarter. They're going to hold for the final second shot. A chance to tie or take the lead on this possession. Lights out. Eight points for him. There's the screen. Six on the clock. They're going a little dip for three. No good. Oh, man. That's a good defense. Grizzlies lead by two entering the fourth. This could go either way. Both teams playing well. Both into the ball. Fourth quarter action coming at you. Yo, Wooka Bear. Thank you for the prime sub, Mr. Wooka Bear. I appreciate you supporting the stream, homie. Thank you so much, bro. You got to help the man guarding the basketball. All right, the fourth quarter of action getting Yeah, both into the ball. Both ends so of your sphincter. Memphis has gotten the three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 Memphis shots the outside the arc. Six of 15. To extend the lead. You've got White. 
G out there with lights out. And Kings are in a little bit of a rough patch. So Good defense down low, up. but the offense is even better. Seven points Beautiful the finish from the block. And, really liking the effort and the Grizzlies are out by, by four. Giving much ground. The scores remain close. I've got a feeling it's going to come down to the wire. Walrus had a double team. Lil dip in the D corner to, to CJ White. Pacor mid-range, got a good he's look, and he connects. And shot. Good well, shot from Zach Pacor. They needed that. And this is when you want to All make right. an impact. You're, you're totally Kings right. pull within quarter, two. They're staying game. with him. This is when the true Holy Fook to sleeper on the block. Plays up and in. Blocks. Defense, not enough. The Wizards got four this quarter. Sleeper playing well. 60% from the field for the Grizzlies. And they're only up by four, man. The Kings are staying within striking distance. Kings, Lil Dip drives. Strip by the Grizzlies. They get a takeaway. The fast break, Zuma passes inside. Walrus the dip, the steal leading to the easy bucket on the other end. And it is a two-point game. Damn great defense from Walrus. Are you kidding me? That went sideways quick for the Grizzlies. The wizard passes Hobbit. The Here's the great. It's wide open at the three-point line. Down Here's to sleeper the again. They're going to keep feeding him. Just five to shoot. Oh, Pacor gets a great stop this time. Blocks him. Over to dip. Here's Walrus. This is for the tie. Walrus is a beast. Five minutes remaining in regulation. We are all tied up here in Sacramento. the great there's the pick Ruben's gonna come and set the screen good defense by quick holy no, fook no. the oh it was too high that would have been so beastly Fourth the Kings with a chance to retake the lead inside no good white no good on the putback Hobbit pushing the tempo that's the prime time Four and a half minutes. Hobbit for the lead. He hits it. Beautiful three from Shredded Hobbit. He can dunk and he can hit the threes. Memphis back out by three. As we get into crunch time. Walrus driving in, blocked by Ruben, who comes across. Oh, what a play by 24. Big smooth, the pass to With Red. a chance to extend the lead even Here's further. This is a big possession for the Grizzlies. Sleeper around. in the paint, double teams. What's he gonna do? Goes up with it, no good. And it's White with the rebound. Kings with a stop. White's got his fifth rebound in this one. They need, to, they need something right here. Quick Inside. and bad. Inside to Walrus. Great pass. Walrus able to finish it with a right hand. Pull the Kings within one. We got nine lead changes. Or excuse me, 11 lead changes, nine ties in this game. Down the stretch. Timeout called the Grizzlies. Is that what it said? Maybe I completely misread that. I don't know. Words are hard. My eyes are just quite not working. Maybe I need to get glasses. Way too many turnovers and looking frustrated. All right, Grizzlies are the one-point lead. Three and a half minutes left here in the fourth. Zuma from the elbow. No good. The Kings with a chance to retake the lead again. Dillard to dip. Oh, dip had room. Ooh, look at him. Look at him. He thinks he can take shredded. Pulls up. Floater. No good off the back iron. Good defense from the Grizz. 50-50 balls. Get into the basket. We have to give it all right now. Hobbit. Oh, my God. The dish into the corner. Jordans. He was wide open. The drive and the dish by Hobbit. That was a good look. To the paint. Five point lead. Oh no, and the Kings turn it over. Memphis could run away with it here. It was red hot. Stolen by Little Dip. It's a fast break. No one's there. Little Dip lays it in with the right hand. They needed that. They really needed that. That is a huge, huge steal by Little Dip. Back to a two-point lead. Courtesy of Under Armour. Unleash chaos. That was a great sequence from the steal all the way to the finish at the other end. Kings need a defensive stop right here. Pass to Red Hot. 
Hobbit in the corner. Here's the closer. Short aims to, to Zuma. To Back to Hobbit. Six on the shot. Good clock. defense. They got to get something. Stolen. No. Dongerson's got to get rid of it. Oh, he nearly got it. Reese O'Neal with the offensive board. He's going to the line. Shooting two. Two minutes left in regulation. Gets the first to go. These are some clutch free throws right here. These are big. One of two. Two of two. Reese O'Neal clutch from the line. Grizz lead by four. Under two minutes left here in this game. Can the Kings come back? left in the fourth quarter. The pass to D. Dillard, size mismatch, pulls up, no it's good. Oh, they wanted that one back. O'Neal's got his seventh rebound. Of Grizzlies the with a chance to pull away. To Hobbit driving up with a right, and he gets it. Six-point lead for the Grizzlies with a minute 30. This is a big possession for the Kings. They need something. Little dip, drives. He's got to get rid of it. Into the corner for Walrus. Step back from the elbow, blocked inside. Jordames, huge defensive stop for the Grizzlies. Jordames, step back, no, decides to hold on to it, passes it back to Hobbit. Only a minute remaining. This could be the dagger. Jordames, elbow jumper, bang! He's insane, he's got 17 points. It is an eight point lead for the Grizzlies. That might be the dagger, oh my God, Jordan. Little dip for three, this is what they need. Hey White, put it back up, Flores for three. No, they missed back to back three opportunities. Jordan's in the paint for two. 70 to 60, 35 on the clock. Memphis shuts the door in the final minutes. Oh my God, Memphis played well. Down the, just in the final minutes, Kobe Jordan's 19 points. Played great there in the final minutes. Holy shit. That block, and then that two on the other end for the dagger. That was a good game, though, man. That really was a good game. Dude, Jordan's is a beast. He looks like a, he looks like a freak, but he's a good player. 35 seconds down by 10. We need a miracle in, in Sacramento. Little dip. You better shoot that. All right, take the two. All right, take the quick two. 14 6 run for the Grizzlies, man. They need to get a stop here. Get a stop, hit a, hit a three. Good defense. Great defense. Shit. Smooth passes to O'Neal. Memphis moving that ball around. Out of the block. Sleeper! <laughs> oh, that one hurts. Sleeper just slams it in. Oh, that one. Oh, that's the nail in the coffin, boys. That is the nail in the coffin. 72-62. 19 seconds left. I assume the Kings are just going to hold it for the final shot or just dribble it out. There's 18 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Little Here's dip D. for three. No good. Little dip, mark. man. He started off the, the half really well. Did not show up in the final Here's minutes. Smooth. Inside. The oh, this is so nice. BM. Touches. The alley-oop. Alley Bro, Memphis doesn't give a shit. No hesitation doesn't give a shit. The they Sorry go for the alley-oop. The and BM alley-oop in the final right seconds. They win defense. by 12. Memphis completely so no takes the Memphis fourth quarter the in the win. game. Jordan's had himself a ball win. game, boys. He might not be pretty, but he can he, he can play ball. He can most certainly play ball. All right, let's check out this, uh, this box score. Little Dip leading the Kings, 29 points. Two rebounds, five assists, three steals, and two blocks. He was 12 of 25 from the field. 16 for Walrus. He had three assists, two steals. Seven of 20. Well, that's an issue. Uh, 14 and nine for Too Quick in Bed. 13 for Dillard. He had three steals as well. 13 for Pecoria. Three blocks. 14 rebounds for CJ White. 
last. But oh my god, how do you stop these maniacs? Jordan Ames, 33 points, 5 rebounds, 3 assists, 5 blocks. 23, 2, and 5 for Hobbit, 22 for Sleeper, 13, 5, and 5 for Zuma, 13 for Holy Fook, and 12 and 10 for Dongerson. O'Neal and Ruben both got their boards. Two blocks, two blocks, three blocks. Good team effort, man. Reese O'Neal had three steals, seven assists, seven points. Dude, Reese O'Neal was a beast. All right, let's simulate through the day. Let's check out the oops. Let's check out the daily view. We got the Bulls and the Wizards. The Wizards got their 24th win, 114-109, led by Kim Jong Un. 29 points, three rebounds, three assists. 22 and 10 for Hakimi. He also had three steals and two blocks. God damn, Hakimi had himself a game. 16 for Mr. Necked. Magnuson 14. Bigley 24 and 10. 17 for Saplington. 17 for Daniel. 16 for Thompson. Yeet, 9, 6, 8, and 3 with 3 turnovers. And the Bulls fall. T-Wolves and Pacers. Ooh, that is not what I expected. The T-Wolves, 112-103. Jeff Reed for the Pacers, 17 points. 16 for Gangsta, 14 for Sky at 7 assists. 14 for Ty. Speedy, man. William Speedy Schultz is a monster. 31 points, 2 boards, 9 assists, 2 steals. 20 points for Gronkowski. He had three blocks. 13 for Andrews. 13 for Brumfield. 10, 13, 6 with three blocks for Michael Carr, Michael Carr. T-Wolves get their 15th win of the year. Celtics just absolutely decimate the Nets. 114, 88. Will Johns, 21 points. 19, 8, and 6 with four steals for Swole. 19 for Butts. Elderhead, 12. 11 for Smash. 10 for Drew. Nets were led by Chocolate Thunder, 18 points. 14 for Ryan. O'Neal had 13. He had nine assists, two steals. It's not enough, man. Caustic still not playing. And I think that's the issue, man. The Nets need their Caustic back. Lakers lose to the Rockets. 106-93. Excuse me. Lakers beat the Rockets. 106-93. Mark Deshark, 16 points, six rebounds, six assists, two steals. 15 for Magnum. 15 for Bregorbs. 11 for Fork, Stealth, 10 points. Jen had 10. Golgi's nip, though. 21 points, 2 steals, 15 and 8 for Wallace. Franco had 14 and only 18 minutes. 13 for Adrian. And the Lakers get the win, 106-93. Their 23rd win on the year. Hornets get the win over the Clippers, 114-97. JBT had 22 points, 18 for Chop. I'm going to go through these... Uh, these these box scores just a little bit quicker. I'm going to try to because there's a lot to get through. Sensei, 26 and 14, 19 and 10 for Egg. Sangster, 19 points. Hornets had a great game, man. Sensei plays. Six, oh my God, 11 offensive, 17 offensive boards for the Hornets. Thunder Mavs. Oh my God, the Mavericks beat the Thunder. Dude, the Mavericks are starting to bring this season back. Thunder, led by Reznor, 18, 11, and 7. 15 for Rowe, 14, 11 for Xavier. Church had 14. Where's Post? Post, 2 of 11. Oh, that is why they lost. Post Malone did not show up. Tickles had 22 and 11, 19 for Schnick, 19, 5, and 6 with 3 blocks for Vernon Burns. Mavs get their 23rd win on the year. Grizzlies and Kings, we saw that. Sixers and Suns. The Suns get a one-point victory. Look at the fourth quarter. They outscored the 76ers 38-23 to to win by one. The comeback at home. 33 points for Walrus. Nine assists, three steals. Holy shit, Walrus had a great game. Did I say Walrus? Wallace. Siesto, 25-7-10. 28 for Matthew. Darv had 15. Celtic and Back Nasty both had 22 points. 16 for Marsh Dover had 15. Leonard, 15. 14 for Davidson. Sixers lose by one. All right, that is it for December 31st. Let's check out January 1st. Simu it's a new, it's a new month. We are finally in January 2018. Magic vs. Nets. Oh my god. 108-107. The Nets get the win in OT. Jordan, 19 points, 12 rebounds. 
18 and 11 for Thunder, 15, 7, and 5 for O'Neal. He also had three blocks, 15 for Billingsley. Caustic still didn't play. Magic, 19 for Riley, 19 for Keen, 17 and 14 for Vega. He was 7 of 13, 0 of 3 from behind the arc. Four, 7 of 25, Riley? Yikes. Yikes. You cannot shoot that poorly, man. You got to shoot better than that if your team's going to win. Bucks and Raptors, 103-92. The Raptors beat the Bucks, their 13th win of the year. Led by Young Diesel, 22 points, 5 assists, 15 and 8 for Johnson. Johansson had 13 and 7. The Bucks led by Blue, 20 points, 13 for Badger. And the second high score on the Bucks, 13. 12 for Sniper Cats, 7 rebounds, 5 assists, 4 blocks. Too bad he was 5 of 14 from the field. Clifford, the Big Red Dog, 10 points, 16 boards. The Bucks get their 15th loss of the year. Trailblazers continue to roll. 27 wins on the year. They win 104-98 over the Bulls. Thompson had 24 points, 16 and 9 for Beefy. Chief and Vikingston both had 22 points. Chief had nine boards, four assists, three steals, two blocks, 14 for Kenny Powers, and three players with 10 points for the Portland Trailblazers. Nine assists. For Craven Moorhead with four steals. Lakers and T-Wolves. Oh, the Lakers get their 24th win. 89-88. Schultz put up a big game. 27 points, 7 assists, 3 steals. 15 and 13 with 2 blocks for Carmichael. But the Lakers hold on. 25 points for Golgi's Nip. 12 points for Harm. 6 steals. 11 and 10 for Adrian and Wallace. And it's a 1-point victory. All right, that is it for January 1st. Now, at the end of January 1st, there should be actual award races. We actually have proper awards. Let's see who is leading the award races thus far for the season. MVP race, Manuel Vega. 26.1 points per game. Brody Scott, number two. Kenny Powers, Sneaky Snake, and Post Malone. Those are your current leaders for MVP. Yeah, no Jimmy Bones. No Jimmy Bones. I cannot believe that. Manuel Vega, though, 26.1 points per game. Rookie of the year, Manuel Vega. Jimmy Bones is in there for rookie of the year. He's averaging 16.6 points per game, 12.9 rebounds, 6.4 assists. Yeah, I mean, Jimmy Bones is a monster. Good God. Posty's in here as well. Wait, how is Jimmy in here? And he's ahead of Post. But Post is ahead of Jimmy here. What the fuck? Sixth man of the year. I told you guys. Holy fook. 15.4 points per game. Jacob Drew, the center for the Boston Celtics, though. Right there. Craven Moorhead for the Blazers. Jack Daniels and Jordan Rubin. Defensive player of the year. Clifford leading the way. Wildman eating Hakimi. Anal Konjic and Unmod Mini. Clifford, the big red dog, man. Two steals a game, 2.3 blocks a game. And we'll see who gets most improved player. I guess nobody. Let's check out the players of the week. December 17th to December 23rd, Manuel Vega and William Speedy Schultz. Actually, I think we already saw that one. 1 a.m. Mark DeShark, players of the week. Mark DeShark got his, is that his second one? No, that is, Mark DeShark gets his first player of the week. Despite how well he's been playing. And 1A, he gets his first as well. Player of the month. Sniper Cat gets player of the month for the Bucks for December. And Mark DeShark is your player of the month for the Western Conference. Holy shit. All right. All-star voting looks about the same. We just looked at it not too long ago. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's continue this shit. January second, simulate through the dates. Ooh, Walrus. Wait, the Kings. Oops, my bad. Oh my god, Trailblazers and Cavaliers. One twenty six eighty five. The final. Are you kidding me? Trailblazers uh, might be the first team with thirty wins. Talladay had 15 points for the Cavs, 6 boards, 6 assists, 13 for Guy, 12 for McBuckets, 11 and 11 for Lester and Toboggan, 
37 points, 14 rebounds, 4 assists on 15 of 26 from the field. 6 offensive boards. Kenny Powers. Oh, my Lord. 22 points for Chief. 21 for Porterhouse. He had 7 assists. 14 and 10 for Vikingston and Abbott. Uh, that is that is just a fucking beating. Spurs Knicks. Spurs get to win 115-98. Devil Blade put up 20 points, 13 assists for the Knicks. Tucker Boner, 15 and 5. 12 points for Gamer. Amazing Cock, 28 points, 5 rebounds, 8 assists in the win for the Spurs. 17 for Jake. He also had 5 assists, 4 steals, and 4 blocks. 14 and 8 for Blast Dog. 13 for Chu in only 11 minutes. Spurs get a win. They're 11th of the year. Hawks and Suns. Hawks get the win. 131-125. Siesto, 26 points, 12 assists. 23 for Darb. 16 and 10 for Stanley. 15 and 9 for Wallace. 21 and 21 for Garcia and Hup. 17 and 10 for Gwilly. 17 and 9 for Creason. 15 points for La Susa. He also had 7 assists. Cox and Daly both had over 10 points. Hawks get their 16th win on the year. Hornets Kings. Kings get another win. 19 points for Walrus. Three assists, three steals. 19 and 7. Or 19, 7 and 7 for Teske. 18 for Dip. 16 and 10 for White. Dillard, 14 points, 3 rebounds, 7 assists, and 2 steals. Palmquist had 17. 14 and 13 for 1A. Uh, 13 for Dover and 10 for Sullivan O'Neal. He also had 7 turnovers and 8 assists. God, the Kings wrecked them. And the Grizzlies and the Clippers. The Clippers get the win, 123-104 at home. Led by DeHaiti, 22, 8 and 8. 17 for Stewart, 17 for Phelps. 15 and 13 for Chop. Good God, man. How many players? Six, seven, eight players with over 10 points for the Clippers. 20 points for Jordames. He had five steals as well and seven boards. Double double for Hobbit. 17 points, 10 assists. 17 and 8 for Holy Fook off the bench. 12 points for Sleeper. Grizzlies fall though. Nearly a 20 point loss. All right, on to January 3rd. Let's check out. The day. The Rockets and the Magic. The Rockets get their 22nd win of the year. 128 106, a 22 point win. Manuel Vega tried to carry the team for the Vega, or for the Magic. 24 points, 5 boards, 13 assists. 12 and 12 for No Blotch. Lamar in action tried to play some D. 5 steals, 3 blocks for Lamar. Bolt action had four, 3 steals. Keen had 4 steals. Too bad he shot 3 of 13 from the field. Mark Deshart continues to show why he's one of the best players in the league. 34 points, 6 rebounds, 8 assists, 2 steals. 18 for Jenny at 7 assists, 17, 9, and 11 for Stealth. One rebound away from a triple double. 17 for Fork and 17 for Grek. Brock, double double with five blocks. Everyone doing their part for Houston. 104 94, Sixers get the easy win over the Spurs. Marsh, 24 points, six rebounds, 10 assists, four blocks. Double double for Davidson. He also had six steals and three blocks. Holy shit. Dem boys. Prater had 19, 18 for Jake. Cock, 13, 9, and 6 with three steals and two blocks. They lose by 10. 112, 103. Wizards take down the Knicks behind Kyle Breeth's 37 point. Oh my God, performance. Six rebounds, two steals, two blocks. Excuse me, two assists, two blocks. 18 and 7 for Hakimi. He also had three blocks. 18 points for Chaos. Hines, one assist for away from a double double. Boner had 20 points, seven, uh, seven assists, 15 and 11 for Blade. Quan and Barry both with 14. Wizards roll to their 25th win on the year. T Wolves and Nets. The Nets get demolished by 20. Nets were led by Ryan. He had 22 points, 21 for Thunder, 19 for Jordan. Schoenfeld had 16. 33 points for I. Williams, Speedy Schultz. Three rebounds, five assists, two steals. 
21 and 7 for Andrews. Gronkowski had 21 as well. Carmichael, one assist away from a triple double. 20 points, 12 rebounds, 9 assists, 3 blocks. T Wolves get a big win. Pistons Heat. Pistons 109. Heat 90. The, uh, Michael Queen, 22 points. 21 for Eagle, 12 for Jimmy Bones, man. Jimmy not really playing well recently. 21 points for Nathan King Carter to lead the Pistons. 17 for Yalito, 16 for Sensei, 12, 10, and 10 for Cox, Blanca, and Dago. Dago, Dago, or Dago with the double double. The Dago, Dago. 13 blocks as a team. That's the difference. Cavs and Celtics, 121, 104. The Celtics win 29 points from Swole and Stephenson. They lead the way for the Celtics. 22 points for Talladay and Lester. Toboggan put up 19. And the Cavaliers continue to show why they're one of the worst teams in the league. 11 and 27. Raptors get their 14th win of the year. 122-116. They beat the Bulls. Despite Jumbo Dogs, 28 points, 5, 15 rebound performance. Thompson had 20. 17 for Saplington. Diesel, 22 points, 9 assists, 2 steals. 17 and 10 for Johnson, the double double. 17 for time, 14 and 14 for Minnie and Johansson. And it's enough. The Raptors, they get the win, man. Everybody doing their part, except for Ron Dogs. Ron Dogs still sucking dick. Pacers and Bucks. Pacers, 118, 111 over the Bucks. 29 points for Blue. Mioff had 19, 17, and 8 for Sniper Cat. He was 0 of 3 from behind the arc. Not doing, not doing what he usually does. Brody Scott and Galactic Gangsta both putting up 28 per point performances. Despite an 8 of 20 from the field for Gangsta. O'Neal at 16 and 12, the big double double. Mavericks Warriors. Warriors 121 and 106. They get the win. Vernon Burns led the way for the Mavs. 24, 7 and 4. 19 for Myers. Snake, 18, 7 and 5 with three steals. Mike Hunt, 26 points, 7 assists. Johnson with a double double, 21 points, 13 boards, 3 assists, and 4 blocks. That's your league leader in blocks. Graves had 18, 17, 4, and 9 for Pleblo. Warriors, 19 and 19 on the year. 117, 107. The Nuggets roll over the Suns at home. 35 points for Wong, he had 9 rebounds. 21, 4, and 12 for White. 16, 9, and 10 for Custer. These three, man, doing it all. 22 points for Siesto. 19 for Darb. 18 for Wallace. 12 for Samuel. Three blocks for Darb. Too bad. So sad. Nuggets too good. 117, 104. The Jazz beat the Pels. 42 points for Matsko. 12 rebounds, 2 assists, 18 and 10 for Fairlight. Motsko has been playing out of his mind. Let's see. Look at his recent games. Last two games, look at that. Holy shit, Motsko. Apparently Motsko's got to drop nearly 40 every game to get a win. Torres had 20 points. 19 for Satora. 15, 13, and 5 with 3 steals for Thiel. Pels fall. And Thunder Lakers, Lakers 110-100, their 25th win on the year. Keen, 21 points, 17, 3, and 5 with 4 steals for Nip. 17, 17 points in 10 minutes for Cox. 15 for Wallace. A, oh, a one assist away from a triple-double for Kearns. Xavier had thir 23 points for the Thunder. Post Malone, 17 and 8 with 7 assists. 2 steals and 2 blocks. 15 and 14 for Reznor. Lakers win by 10. All right, January 24th. Simulate through the day. I think there's only two games this day. Warriors Rockets 129 124. The Rockets hold on to win. Led by Mark DeShark, 29 points, 8 assists. 26 2 and 9 for Fork. Jen added 18 2 and 6. Still 14 points, 7 rebounds, 4 assists. Rockets, man. They continue to do well. 31 points for Hunt. 21 and 10 double double for Gambino. 19 and 16 for Johnson with five more blocks. He had seven offensive rebounds. Pleblo with a triple double. 14 points, 11 boards, 10 assists, three steals. Warriors fall. They lose by five. 
Thunders Clippers. Thunders. Thunder Clippers. 198. The Thunder outscored the Clippers 38 to 27 in the final quarter to win. Batista put up 28, 7, and 6. 15 for Chop, 15 for Phelps. Tahiti at 12. Thunder led by Post Malone, 27 points. 18 and 9 for Wood, 17 and 15 for Reznor. He had four blocks. Holy shit. 12 for Xavier. And the Thunder get their 22nd victory of the season. All right, January 5th. Simulate the day. Daily View. All right, Knicks and Heat. 132-114. 25 points for Michael Queen, le leading the Heat, but it's not enough. Four steals as well. 22 for Newman, 16 for Eagle, 13 to 11 for Ugly. 26 and 12 for Kenny. Also had two steals and three blocks. Double Blade had a good game, 21 and 14. 21 points for Quan, 17 for Mann in only 18 minutes. Barry, double double. Tucker Boner, 11 points. Thankfully, some other players stepped up, and the Knicks get their 19th win on the year. One game back of 500. Pistons Sixers, 107-88. The Pistons roll. Davidson had 21. Bagnesti had 15. Benjamin had 15. 21 and 21 for Daigle and Nathan King Carter to lead the Pistons. Daigle is 10 of 14 from the field. 13 for Alito. Sensei had 10 points, 3 rebounds, 7 assists, and 7 steals. God damn. Uh, T-Wolves and Celtics. The Celtics get a win. They're 23rd of the year. Teddy Swole. 35 points, 10 boards, 14 assists. The triple-double. He was 5 of 8 from behind the arc. 12 of 18 from the field. 16 of 5 for Johnson. 16 and 7 for Drew. He had 3 blocks. 13 points for Johns. Carmichael at 18, 7, and 3 with 8 blocks. Double double for Schultz, 16 and 10. Gronk had 12. The Celtics, though, man. Teddy Swolesvelt, just too goddamn swole. Raptors, Bucks. Bucks get the win, 107 102. They're 21st of the year. Mioff had 25 points, 21 and 11 for Sniper Cast. 14 for Blue. Double double for Clifford. He also had five blocks. Raptors, 22 points for Diesel, three rebounds, nine assists, 17 for Johnson, 14 for Mini. He had four steals. Raptors fall. 23rd loss on the year. Bulls, Mavs. The Bulls, 121-100. Snake had 19 points. 16 and 7 for McElmo. Seafelt, 15 points, 14 rebounds. The double-double. Vernon -double. Burns, double-double as well. He had four blocks. Sablington puts up 24 points to lead all scores. Jumbo Dog, 22, 12, and 8. 20 points for Thompson. Isaiah Yee, 10 points, 8 boards. The Bulls, 21-point victory over Dallas. 110-101, the Suns defeat the Spurs, giving the Spurs their 29th loss of the year. Amazing Cock had 22-8-5 to lead. 19-1-7 for Bell. Jake, 18-8-10 with four steals. Had, a, had himself a game. But the Suns, somehow, 17 points for Knight to lead all scores. To, sorry, to lead scores for the Sun. Six assists, three steals. 15 and 13 for Stanley, 13 for Siesto. 10 points for Darb and Corrupt. They put up 110. The Suns get their 17th win on the year. God, it was like the two worst teams in the West battling. Jazz and Nuggets. Okay, never mind. The Jazz is the worst team in the West. We, are, I think, the worst team in the league. 116, 102. <coughs> Wong puts up a double double. 24 and 12. White puts up a double-double as well. 23 points, 11 assists. 11 for DiStefano, Joe, and Dyes to lead the Nuggets. Matsko, 32 points. 11 for Guy, 11 for Lester, 11 for Reynolds, 10 and 10 for Fairlight and Fur. And the Jazz fall. Matsko trying to do it all. Wizards, Grizzlies. Hey, the Wizards win 113-109. Their 26th win of the year. Led by Kyle Breeth, 22, 8, and 3. Phillips had 20. 18 for Kim Jong-un. 12 for Chaos. 23 points for Jordan. So he also had 6 rebounds, 5 assists, 4 blocks, 2 steals. Hobbit, 18, 5, and 11. 15 for Ruben. 14 for Zuma. Holy Fook, 12 off the bench, 7 assists, 3 steals. 
The Grizzlies lose by four. That's probably another great game. Hawks Trailblazers. Hey, Trailblazers get their 29th win on the year. One away from 30. The first team to 30. 115, 110. Penny Powers had 23 points, 11 rebounds. 22 for Vikings. Then Chief, 16, 7, and 7, 15, and 10. Forget it. La Sousa and Garcia both had 18 points, 17 for Cox, 13, 11, and 10. Double double for Creason. Willie, 4 of 14 from the field. The Hawks, man, they just can't hang with the Blazers. They can't do it. And then the Lakers absolutely roll through the Hornets. 25 points leading the way for Nip. 21 for Wallace. 17 for Keen. 10 and 10 for Harmon Adrian. Dover led the Hornets. 17 points. He had seven steals. Three players with 10 with double digits. 10 points for O'Neal. 10 for Canuck and 10 for Whitehead. Hornets with a big loss. They're 18th on the year. Lakers 26 and 12 on the season. All right, the last day of the week. Let's simulate it. Daily View. Warriors go to 20 and 20 on the year. They get a win over the Clippers. 116-101. Haiti had 22 points, 9 rebounds, 18 and 18 for Chop and Stewart. 25 and 11 leads the Warriors for, for Mr. Johnson. 19 and 6 for Escobar, 16 for Hunt. Graves, one point away from a double double himself. Celtics won by one over the Nets, their 24, 24th win of the year. Thunder at 23, 9 and 4, 19, 7 and 7 for O'Neal, 18 for Ryan. Led by Teddy, 26 points, 9 rebounds, 7 assists, 2 steals, and a block. The second most rebounds on the team. He's 5'10", 178 pounds. 20 and 10 for Drew, 19 for Butts, 13 for Johns, 10 for Johnson. 5 blocks. They hold on to win by 1. Rockets and Pistons going to OT. And the Pistons win! 128-126. Led by Nathan King Carter, 21 points, 20 for Sensei, 19 and 12 for Daigle. Richard Cox had 18. 25 points for Fork, it's not enough. 22, 7 and 5 for Mark DeShark. Stealth, 18 points, 14 assists, 3 steals. Rockets fall, their 15th loss of the year. Bulls, Pacers, 106, 100. The Bulls get the win, their 23rd of the year. Brody Scott and Galactic Gangsta both put up 22 points. 22, 8, and 7 for Scott. 22, 9, 3, and 3 for Gangsta. Saplington had 26, enough to lead all scorers and for the win. 22 for Thompson. 21 and 10 for Jumbo Dong. Pacers fall. Oh, man. Uh, Cavs Magic. Oh, my God. The Cavaliers, 127-105. Manuel Vega puts up 35 points with 15 assists. Can someone help this man? Dear God. Poor Vega. 15 points for Keane. 14 and 9 for Lamar. 12 and 12 for Walker and Hendricks. Cavs led by McBuckets and Toboggan, each with 25 points. 13 boards for Toboggan Finkel out of 19. 16 for Lester. 15, 6, and 3 for Talladay. And the Cavs get nearly a, or get a 22-point win over the Orlando Magic on the road. The Wizards get a big win at home against the Bucks. They're 27th of the year, 126, 114, led by Chaos with 24 points, 5 assists. 23 and 11 for Breeth. Hines, 16, 3 and 8. A double-double for Hakimi. He also had six blocks. 23 points for Blue, leading the Bucks. Three rebounds, two assists, two steals. 22 points for Badger. Mioff had 16. Nerdorino had 16. Sniper Cat, 11, 7, and 10. Clifford, 12 rebounds, eight assists. Only four points. And the Bucks lose. Pelicans and T-Wolves. The T-Wolves with a huge win. Led by Carmichael, 32 points, 4 rebounds, 5 assists, 13 of 18 from the field. 16 points for Schultz, he also had 7 assists and 9 steals. 15 for Gronkowski, Howard, 11 and 10. Satora had 20, 17 for Lil Suck. Stutter and Torres with over 15 points. 
T Wolves, though, man. Oh, oh, man. Had nearly 20 more shot attempts than the Pelicans. And the Kings get a win 107 97. Their 17th of the year. CJ White. Oh, my God. 23 points, 16 rebounds, 6 assists. 18 and 8 for Pacor. 17, 7 and 8 for Dillard. 16 for Lil Dip. 11 assists are too quick in bed. Wong led 20 points, 13 rebounds, 16 for White. Joe had 16 as well. And the Nuggets fall to 15 and 24 on the year. Good God. All right, let's check out our standings. That is it. We are through January 6th, 2018. Let's check out the standings really quick. Lakers lead the Pacific seven games up of the Warriors. They are on a seven game win streak. And they are 8-2 and two in their last 10. In the Atlantic Division, you got the Boston Celtics a half game ahead of the 76ers. They have won four straight. 76ers are 4-6 and six in the last 10. So the Celtics have, have taken the Atlantic Division. Pacers are a half game ahead of the Pistons, even though the Pistons have won five, seven games in a row. They are coming up here in the Central Division. We got a very tight race. Chicago Bulls, they've won two. They're only three and a half games back. Southeast Division, led by the Wizards. They've won four straight. And the Magic have lost five straight. Oh, man, the Wizards are pulling away here in the Southeast Division. Southwest, still led by the Rockets. But the Mavericks, only a game back. All the teams in this division are on a losing streak. Portland Trailblazers, they have won 10 in a row. 15 and 4 on the road, 15 and 4 in the conference, 10 and 0 in their last 10, outscoring their opponents by 11.2. They are one game away from being the first team to 30. They are seven and a half games ahead of the Oklahoma City Thunder. Laker, and that is it. That is everybody. Good God. All right, let's check out the injury report just really quick. Boozy, Burt still out. Curry, Schuler, Davis, Clean, Litteris. Doesn't look like there's any other big injuries, so that's good. Looks like it's pretty much just everybody else. A lot of day-to-days. Upcoming free agents. Ooh, Mark the Shark. An upcoming free agent. Teddy Swole, Fork, McBuckets. There's going to be a lot of good players in free agency, man. Wait, it doesn't matter. We're not even going to get through one season. Did Schuler wait? Schuler was hurt before, wasn't he? High right, high right ankle sprain. Oh my God, high right ankle sprain. Two to four weeks. Oh, that's rough. Yeah, he just. Oh no, 1225. Yeah, it didn't have. It happened against Boston. Oh no, it happened against Orlando, I think. So he's only sat one game. Only one game. And you guys won anyway. 